Hello everyone, today I am going to start with the topic application of enzyme therapeutic and diagnostic. We can say therapeutic and diagnostic application of the enzymes. The therapeutic importance and uh, diagnostic importance or application of enzymes do different tarike se hum samjhenge to first we will go for the therapeutic importance or application of enzyme and after that we will continue with the diagnostic application the therapeutic application kya hai iska the therapeutic uh, enzymes are those enzymes which can be used medically isolatedly with other therapy with the uh, purpose of treatment of the various disease safely right the therapeutic enzymes aise enzymes hote hain jinko hum medically use kar sakte hain kisi bhi disease ko cure karne ke liye unko hum bahar se synthesize kare in vitro ya in vivo synthesize karenge uh, lab mein synthesize karke un enzymes ko administered karke hum disease ko cure karne ke liye use karenge to ye hota hai aapka therapeutic uh, application of enzymes jin enzymes ko hum बाहर से अप्लाई करके या उनकी कंसंट्रेशन को इंक्रीज करके उनको सिंथेसाइज करेंगे हम उनको बाहर से एडमिनिस्टर करके और डिजीज को क्योर करेंगे डायग्नोस्टिक के लिए ऐसे एंजाइम्स जिसके एलिवेशन या जिसकी डिफिशेंसी से हम ये पता लगा सकें कि ये डिजीजेस हो रही हैं फॉर एन एग्जांपल इफ यू रिमेंबर द लेक्चर ऑफ आइसो एंजाइम आई डिस्कस्ड अबाउट दी एंजाइम लाइक एल डी एच लेक्टेड डी हाइड्रोजनेज वॉज देयर जहाँ पर एल डी एच वन एंड एल डी एच फाइव एल डी एच वन जो था उसकी एलिवेटेड इंक्रीज कंसनट्रेशन या एलिवेटेड अमाउंट वॉज रिस्पॉन्सिव फॉर शो करता था कि माओकार्डियल इन्फेक्शन है तो माओकार्डियल इन्फेक्शन को डिटरमाइन या डिटेक्ट करने के लिए डायग्नोज करने के लिए हम एल डी एच वन की वैल्यू को डिटेक्ट कर सकते हैं और हम उसको कर सकते हैं सो दे आर दिस दिस आई थिंक यू अंडरस्टैंड द थेरापेटिक एप्लीकेशन एंड डायग्नोस्टिक एप्लीकेशन थेरापेटिक के लिए ऐसे एंजाइम्स जिसको सिंथिसाइज करके या जिसको बाहर से एडमिस्टर्ड करके हम किसी भी डिजीज को क्योर करें वो कहलाएगा थेरापेटिक एंजाइम्स और डायग्नोस्टिक एंजाइम एंजाइम्स की कंसनट्रेशन बॉडी के अंदर इंक्रीज है एलिवेटेड है या डिक्रीज है या कम हो गई है उसकी कंसनट्रेशन को मेजर करके किसी भी डिजीज को आइडेंटिफाई करना दैट इज अ डायग्नोस्टिक एप्लीकेशन तो थेरापेटिक एप्लीकेशन के लिए द थेरापेटिक एंजाइम आर दो एंजाइम विच कैन बी यूज मेडिकली आइसोलेटेड विद द अदर थेरेपीज विद द पर्पज ऑफ द ट्रीटमेंट ऑफ द वेरियस डिजीज सेफली नो सोर्स ऑफ दी थेरापेटिक एजेंट्स क्या हैं थेरापेटिक एजेंट्स क्या हो सकते हैं थेरापेटिकली एंजाइम हम कैसे क्या क्या सोर्सेज हैं इनके तो फर्स्ट इज द एनिमल सोर्स सो कैमोट्रिप्सिन डाइजेस्टिव एंजाइम है विच कैन बी प्रिपेयर बाय द ऑक्स बाइल एंड एंड पैंक्रियाज लाइपेज फ्रॉम द पैंक्रियाज यूरोकाइनेज फ्रॉम द ह्यूमन यूरिन लाइसोजेम्स फ्रॉम द हेन एग पेप्सिन फ्रॉम द डॉग हॉग्स पैंक्रियाज दन इज द प्लांट सोर्स प्लांट सोर्स है पैपिन एक एंजाइम है विच कैन बी ऑप्टेन फ्रॉम द पपाया ब्रोरोबिलीन फ्रॉम द पाइन एप्पल अमाइनेज फ्रॉम द बार्ली नेटोकाइनेज फ्रॉम द नेटो माइक्रो माइक्रोबियल सोर्सेस स्टेप्टोकाइनेज फ्रॉम द हिमोलेटिक स्टेप्टोकोकाई बैक्टीरिया ग्लूटामेज फ्रॉम द इकोलाई एमाइलेज फ्रॉम द बैसिलस बैक्टीरिया लाइपेज फ्रॉम दिलस से हम ऑप्टेन कर सकते हैं दीज आर द माइक्रोबियल सोर्सेज फॉर द एंजाइम द माइक्रोव्स आर प्रिफर्ड रैदर देन द एनिमल सोर्स एंड द प्लांट सोर्स द माइक्रोबियल सोर्स आर मोर प्रिफर्ड टू द आइसोलेशन ऑफ द एंजाइम्स बिकॉज दे आर चीपर टू प्रोड्यूस प्लांट एंड एनिमल सोर्स कंटेन मोर हार्मफुल मटेरियल दैन द माइक्रोव एंड इट इज क्वाइट डिफिकल्ट टू सेग्रीगेट दीज एंड वहाँ से ऑप्ट करना बहुत ही मुश्किल हो जाता है और वेरी लो कंसनट्रेशन में ही हमें ये एंजाइम्स नीड मिल पाते हैं सो द माइक्रोव्स आर प्रिफर्ड फॉर द सिंथेसिस ऑफ द थेरापेटिक एंजाइम्स स्टेप्टोकाइनेज की बात करें तो स्टेप्टोकाइनेज इज द वन ऑफ द थेरापेटिक एंजाइम्स विच इज ऑप्टेन फ्रॉम द बीटा हिमोलेटिक 
beta hemolytic streptococci it is antigenic can use hypersense can be used for the hypersensitivity reaction Streptokinase is used to dissolve blood clot that have formed in the blood vessels. कहाँ use करते हैं? जब blood clot present हो जाए blood vessels के अंदर, तो उसको dissolve करने के लिए, remove करने के लिए streptokinase नाम का enzyme use करता है. Use करते हैं, ये क्या करता है? ये blood clot को dissolve कर देता है, blood vessels से remove करने में help करता है. तो streptokinase is used to dissolve the blood clot that have formed in the blood vessel. The another enzyme, therapeutic enzyme is urokinase. The urokinase is a uplasminogen activator. Uplasminogen activator. It is isolated from the human urine. Now it is prepared by the culture human kidney cells. अब आजकल इसको प्रिपेयर किया जाता है कल्चर फॉर्म में बाय द ह्यूमन ह्यूमन किडनी सेल एक्टिवेट्स प्लाज्मिनोजन डायरेक्टली एंड नॉन एंटीजेनिक नेटोकाइनेस इट इज एक्सट्रैक्टेड फ्रॉम आर ट्रेडिशनल जापानीज फूड कॉल्ड नाटोस चीज लाइक फूड होता है एंड इट इज प्रोड्यूस बाय द फ्रेगमेंटेशन प्रोसेस adding the bacillus to the boiled soya beans. Boiled soya bean mein bacillus bacteria ko add karke soya bean ka fragmentations karaya jata hai jahaan se isko extract kiya jata hai. Yeh ek cheese like food hota tha, Japanese food hota hai, natto wahaan se isko liya jata hai, extract out kiya jata hai, that is called as natto kinase. It dissolves the fibrin directly, fibrin that is the clotting factor, it dissolves the fibrin directly, enhance the blood production of the plasmin, uh, sorry, enhance the uh, body production of the plasmin. The next one is papin, protein cleavage enzyme derived from the papaya, papaya se derived kiya jata hai aur ye kya karte hai? protein ka cleavage karte hai, protein ka fragment, uh, breakdown karte hai used to pro remove the wounds in the hospitals. They are basically used in the hospitals to, to remove the wounds. It is used in the treatment of the jellyfish and stings. Agar aap in uh, insect ya fir jellyfish cut le to uske treatment ke liye bhi usko use kiya jata hai. The it is an ingredient of a cleaning solution of a contact lens. The contact lens ka jo cleaning ingredient hai, us mein bhi yeh use hota hai. Some of the important therapeutic enzymes, jaysay aspergerin hai, reaction kya hai iska, L-aspergerin jo hai, water ke saath react karke, L-aspartate or ammonia mein convert ho jata hai, therapeutic use iska leukemia mein hai, collagen, collagen hydrolysis ka function karta hai, and it is used in the skin, also, next one is a glutamase, L-glutamate react with the water and it is converted into L-glutamate and ammonia used in the leukemia. Hydronate, it is used in the heart attack. Lysozyme, used in the, used as a antibiotic. Lysozyme is used as a antibiotic, ribonuclease used as an antiviral, beta lactamase it is used as a penicillin allergy, streptokinase it is used in the blood clot, trypsin it is inflammation used in the inflammation, uricase it is used in the therapeutic treatment of the gout, Thera uh, urokinase it is used in the blood clotting it is used to dissolve the blood Clot. Again, the Jadatar use hota hai, streptokinase, which is used in the remove the blood clot, urokinase jo hai, used in the blood clot, aspergenin jo hai, or aapka glutaminase jo hai, use hota hai, leukemia mein, glycogenase jo hai, use hota hai, aapka skin ulcer mein, Hydro, uh, hydrodinase jo hai, use hota hai, aapka heart attack mein, lysozyme is used as an antibiotic. 
So, these are the some important therapeutic enzymes. Now, coming to the diagnostic important or diagnostic application of the enzyme. For the diagnostic purpose, the enzyme can be divided into a two groups, the plasma specific or plasma functional enzyme and the non plasma specific group. The plasma specific group, uh, plasma specific or plasma functional enzyme, the second one is non plasma specific and plasma non functional enzyme. Let us see one by one. First, plasma specific. Plasma specific present in the plasma normally and have specific function. Their value is high in the plasma rather than the tissues. Plasma may in ki concentration jada hai rather than the tissues may. They are mainly synthesized in liver and enter the circulation. They are mainly synthesized in the liver and then enter in the circulation. For an example, lipoprotein lipase. Plasmin, thrombin, cerebroplasmin, and many other. They are impart impartment of the liver function or genetic disorder leads the enzyme deficiency. For an example, Wilson disease deficiency of the cerebroplasmin. These are the plasma specific. But these plasma specific are not used for the diagnostic function. They are not used for the diagnostic function because they are synthesized in the liver and entered into the circulation and they have the specific function. They are not used for the diagnostic purpose. For the diagnostic purpose, the non plasmic, non plasma specific enzymes are used. The non plasma specific enzyme, these are the enzymes present in the low level in the plasma as compared to the tissue. ठीक है ये प्लाज्मा में लो लेवल में प्रेजेंट होते हैं जबकि प्लाज्मा स्पेसिफिक जो थे नॉर्मली हाई कंसंट्रेशन में प्रेजेंट होते हैं और टिश्यू में कम होते हैं इसका विपरीत है नॉन प्लाज्मिक में नॉन प्लाज्मिक नाम से ही पता चल रहा है कि प्लाज्मा में इनकी कंसंट्रेशन कम होगी और टिश्यूज में इनकी कंसंट्रेशन ज्यादा होगी ठीक एज कंपेयर टू दी टिश्यू एस्टिमेशन ऑफ द एक्टिविटीज ऑफ दीज एंजाइम्स सर्व्स फॉर द diagnosis and prognosis of the several disease and they are marker of the disease. So, remember that the enzymes are classified into a two groups plasma specific and non plasma specific. The plasma specific enzymes are not used for the diagnosis only the non plasma specific are used for the diagnostics purpose and these enzymes are having a low concentration in the plasma and high concentration in the tissue. They are used as the marker of the diseases because they increase the Q use karte Q ki in the certain condition, certain conditions mein inki jo concentration hai plasma mein elevate ho jayegi jisko as a hum diagnostic purpose se use kar sakte hai. Jaise cellular damage ho jaye, increase or rate of the cell turnover, purification of the cell ho jaye, koi injury ho jaye, thik hai, necrosis ho jaye, purification ho jaye. In these cases, the concentration of these, these enzymes increases in the plasma so we can use for the diagnosis. The important diagnostic enzyme jaise hamara amino transferase ho gaya, aspartate amino transferase jaise ki AST jisko hum SGOT use karte hain, myocardial infection but also in the liver kam, myocardial ke liye jada. Aniline amino transfer जिसको हम ALT और SGPT use करते हैं viral hepatitis या jaundice के लिए amylase, acute pancreas, celluloplasmin, creatinine kinase इसको हम लोग पढ़ चुके हैं creatinine kinase को isozyme में lactate dehydrogenase isozyme को इसको भी हम लोग isozyme में पढ़ चुके हैं lipase, phosphatase, phosphate, alkaline, isozyme are many other enzymes also which is used as the diagnostic purpose. Ye jo star lage uwe hai, these are the main marker or the principal use for the diagnostic purpose. Let us see one by one. Example do chaar dekhte hai. 
द फर्स्ट टाइम टेकिंग इट इज ट्रांस एमाइनेस ट्रांस एमाइनेस के अंदर दो एंजाइम्स आएंगे हमारे पास एस जी ओ टी एंड एस जी पी टी एस जी ओ टी दैट इज कॉल्ड एज सीरम ग्लूटामिक ऑक्जोलो एसिटिक ऑक्जोलो एसिटिक ट्रांस एमाइनेस सीरम ग्लूटामिक ऑक्जोलो एसिटिक ट्रांस एमाइनेस और इट इज ऑल्सो कॉल्ड एज ए एस टी दैट इज एसपार्टेट एमिनो ट्रांसफरेज is released within the with tissue necrosis it is released with the tissue necrosis jab tissue damaging start hogi to iska release start ho jayega aspartate plus alpha glutarate it's converted into a oxaloacetate and glutamine jahan par transaminase use ho raha hai it is an important enzyme in amino acid trans amino acid metabolism AST is found in the liver, heart, skeleton muscles, kidney, brain, and RBCs. The normal value is fifty to forty U per ml. Clinical importance: Look, it is elevated eight to. Ah, uh, its uh, elevation will be after the myocardial infraction eight to twelve hours. After eight to twelve hours, it will be eleva elevation. 8 टू 12 आवर्स आफ्टर द इन्फ्रैक्शन माओकार्डियल इन्फ्रैक्शन के 8 से 12 घंटे के बाद इसकी जो वैल्यू है वो इंक्रीज कर जाएगी द पीक वैल्यू रीच इज एट ट्वेंटी फोर टू फोर्टी एट आवर्स आफ्टर द माओकार्डियल इन्फ्रैक्शन दिस एंजाइम इज नॉट पर्टिकुलरली इंडिकेटिव ऑफ द एम आई दिस इज नॉट द पर्टिकुलर वी हैव टू सी द अनदर एंजाइम्स टू द एलिवेटेड कंसनट्रेशन ऑफ द अदर एंजाइम एज वेल This is not only the uh, enzyme which is which will say this we have the myocardial infraction. The other condition can also cause a rise in the level. The high level of SGOT may be obtained due to the trauma to the skeleton muscles in liver disease, pancreatitis, titis word जहाँ भी लगा हुआ है जिस organ के साथ वो कहता है inflammation जैसे यहाँ पर pancreatitis है यानि कि inflammation of the pancreas and other. decreased level of enzyme is found in the pregnancy diabetes and very very disease the next enzyme is transaminase ka hi dusra enzyme jo hai wo hai sgpt that is serum glutamic pyruvate pyruvic transaminase or pyruvate transaminase it is called as aniline transaminase that is alt it is uh, responsible for the reaction where the alpha keto glutarate and l amine alanine is converted into a l glutamate and pyruvate alt is particularly uh, diagnostic uh, a diagnostic or the marker enzyme for the liver liver involvement uh, as this enzyme is found predominantly into the hepatocyte because this enzyme is predominantly uh, present in the hepatic tissues so it is used as a marker of a liver disease it is used as a screening of a liver problem the elevated of sgpt in the viral hepatitis diabetics chsf liver damage bile duct problem or the myopathy it is elevated in the jaundice also elevated alt may also cause a directory chronic deficiency the fluctuation of alt level is normal over the course of the day normally the liver disease and the damage or the damage at that is not viral origin the normally normally in the liver disease or the damage that is not a viral that is not been damaged by the viral uh, infection or the viral origin nahi hai then the normal alt and ast ratio jo hoga wo less than 1 hoga agar yahi viral infection hai yani ki viral hepatitis hai then the ratio jo alt on ast ka ratio hai wo greater than 1 hoga the level of ast is elevated in the serum uh, equal to the number of cells which represent the number of cells involved in case of injury the level of l ast rise within 8 hour and peak jo hoga 24 to 36 hour ke baad milega within 3 to 7 days the level of ast should retain to the retain uh, return 
to the pre-injury level unless further injury occur. It means कि जब कोई injury हो कि तो injury के 36, 24 तो 36 hours के बाद जो concentration जो body के अंदर AST का normal level है वो increase हो जाएगा. But after three to seven days वो normalized routine normal values पे आ जाएगा अगर कोई pre फिर से further injury नहीं होती है. The next one is acid phosphatase or it is also called as ACP or hydrolase enzyme. It catalyzes the hydrolysis of the chemical bond, especially it target and break the molecule bond of the phosphate group. ACP can be found in the certain organs and the tissue including the blood cell, bone marrow, spleen, pancreas, liver, kidney. Found in the greatest uh, concentration in the prostate and up to 100 uh, up to 1000 time greater in the seminal fluid than the any other body fluid. The later fact is useful in the forensic science to detect the prosthetic acid pro, uh, phosphatase that is PAP in the vaginal tissue measuring the level greater than 3 unit per ml is used as a supporting evidence that the rape has been occurred. It is stored in the lysosomes and function when these fuse with the endosomes which are acidified while they function therefore, it has, it has a acidic pH. The normal value is 0.132.63 unit per L. The clinical manifestation it appears primarily in the prostate gland and the semen. It is also found in the other organ, but it is very low concentration. The prosthetic and in the erythrocytic enzyme are the two major isoenzyme. The prosthetic isoenzyme are more uh, specific for the prosthetic cancer, widespread the tumor produce high serum acid phosphate level. Amylase diagnosis and the uh, monitor acute uh, pancreatitis, yani ki pancreas ka inflammation. It may also use to diagnose and mentor the chronic pancreatitis and the another disorder that may involve the pancreas. The blood amylase tests use may be used along with the lipase test to detect the pancreatic diseases. The blood amylase test along with the lipase test will be used to detect the pancreas disease. A urine amylase test is also used to detect the pancreatic diseases. Typically, its level in the will minor blood amylase concentration, but both the, the rise and the fall will occur later. Sometime a urine creatinine level may, may be ordered along with the urine anal amylase test. The ratio of amylase to the creatinine can be calculated and used to assess the kidney function. Kidney dysfunction can result in the slower rate of the amylase clearance. The normal level is 0 0.2 to 1.5 unit per ml, peak value in 8 to 12 of onset of the disease and return normal within the 3 to 4 days. Okay. The normal level jo hai amylase ka that is 0 0.2 to 1.5 unit to per liter, but the peak value in the 8 to 12 or onset of the disease, but it will return normal in the 5 days. The another enzymes like lactate dehydrogenase, creatinine phosphatase, alkaline phosphatase we have already discussed under the isozyme chapter. So, we can you can uh, see that lecture also. I hope you uh, you understand this uh, therapeutic and diagnostic application of the enzyme. Thank you.